Phantom is one of the top blockchains that's been around already for a couple of years. It's an EVM, meaning it's very similar to Ethereum. However, it has pretty nice features. It's built by Andrew Kronje, who's very well known in DeFi circles and who's innovating constantly on various products. In this video, I'm going to tell you about one crucial development that cr is coming to Phantom probably in the spring of this year uh, or maybe summer. We're going to see when exactly. This is Phantom Sonic. So Phantom Sonic is currently a closed testnet, but it's going to get an upgrade on the mainnet very, very soon. So basically what you're getting with Sonic is supersonic performance. So basically Phantom will be as fast as Solana uh, and it will allow you to have the Solana-like features, but on Ethereum, uh, on Phantom actually, but on EVM, uh, which is very similar similar to Ethereum. So this is uh, why, why I'm super optimistic about the Phantom. It currently sits at around $2 billion market cap, which is pretty small for a blockchain, but of course, nothing here is financial advice, purely educational purpose. But what Sonic Update is doing is basically giving you the super speed and on top of that uh, reduces storage requirements for the network by up to 90%. Uh, altogether, uh, we should expect around 2000 tw transactions per second. Uh, time to finality, uh, less than one second. Average block time is much smaller. The gas will go down. Uh, basically, you also get this uh, lower storage. So generally speaking, all the good things are coming uh, and this will be the Phantom Virtual Machine, which is uh, superior execution performance compared to the classical standard EVM, uh, Ethereum Virtual Machine, uh, by processing over 65 times more transactions per second, which is really, really crazy. Uh, always, uh, also there's an update on the storage side, uh, as I've mentioned, so they have this Carmen database storage using flat storage as opposed to tree-like structure to simplify that data retrieval and offer reductions in storage requirements. Uh, reducing ar archive node size from above uh, 11 terabytes to below one terabyte, which is also massive. Uh, and then uh, they have the consensus mechanics that they keep con continuing to use, the legacy uh, consensus mechanism. So altogether, uh, this is what's coming. Uh, I'm super excited for that. Uh, and it's definitely worth having a look. Uh, so as you can see here, uh, they want to roll it out in spring 2024. Uh, currently, Sonic offers two different testnets, closed testnet and uh, builder's testnet. Uh, and basically, they will be coming to the mainnet uh, pretty soon from now. So that's why I'm looking at uh, uh, at uh, Phantom right now. Uh, so does the FVM uh, still run Solidity smart contracts? The answer is yes. So it's fully compatible with the EVM. Uh, if you know Sol Solidity, if you did anything on Ethereum, you'll be able to do the same thing on Phantom. So we're probably going to see massive uh, market for uh, phantom meme coins, uh, which is probably the biggest, as well as different DeFi protocols. Uh, so phantom to zero is basically phantom Sonic and it will replace phantom opera. And also there are a couple of other things that if you want to read more about uh, Sonic are all here on the website, if you search for uh, phantom Sonic. So this is it for phantom Sonic. I just wanted to mention that because I think this is a big news, especially in the phantom ecosystem. Uh, definitely have a look also at DeFi Llama for all the stats related to phantom, uh, because I think it's a pretty nice blockchain with also all the new innovations coming along the way and Sonic will definitely be massive. Thank you for watching, subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video.